<sighs> All right. So now I believe we're on day day three. Um, after surgery, Thursday, Friday, Friday, Saturday, Saturday, Sunday, Sunday, Monday. So actually, day four. Uh, oh, day three. We could do day three because I didn't have surgery till like eleven a.m. on Thursday. But in terms of like you know how I'm feeling today, and whatnot. Um, The pain is definitely better than day one and day two, but it still hurts, you know? It's not, um, you know, it, uh, and then today I found out, like, my doctor is a little upset because, like, I, or whatever, his assistant is upset that I was taking too much pain medication and stuff. I've been taking this this stuff they're called Norcos I had a two week supply I got like probably I don't know a little bit left <laughs> uh, but man those first two days that stuff was painful I need I, I was popping pain meds like crazy um, I mean right now like the pain is there it acts up though, like in certain parts of the day for one reason or another, it does act up. <clears throat> but I don't know, I kind of I'm I'm kind of seeing myself ease off the pain medication like, you know, in the near future, like within a day or two, but we'll see how that goes. Um I'm still not like exercising and stuff. Like the other day I wanted to do some like push-ups and stuff like that but I decided not to because I can't shower right now because I got these stockings on and this brace on and my doctor I'm not gonna see him till Friday so um, yeah I don't want to you know like it's all I'm already like pretty much just bathing myself with a washcloth I don't want to get all sweaty too you know so so it's all right like so this week I'm not gonna work out um let me see what else I mean that's pretty much it man there's something you know um I wish I could report to you that yeah I was able to run you know a mile today in seven minutes six minutes thirty seconds but or even better run two miles sprinting all straightaways and jogging the the curves <laughs> or better yet sparring with people you know or maybe hitting the slopes uh, but yeah I can't say all that right now um, but but I think you know I think the surgery went well though like because like I'm I, like when I straightened my leg I remember before when I used to straighten my leg it used to hurt like now when I straighten it that pain isn't there, you know? So that's something that's good. I'm still not able to flex my quads though, you know? Um, yeah. So I think I'm, uh, once again, I, I, I still think I'm headed in the right direction right now. Um, this was my best bet, you know? This was my best bet. If I didn't have the surgery, then I I know for sure I wouldn't be able to like you know fight again I wouldn't be able to like ski again stuff like that you know at least now that I got the surgery done um, I increased my chances of getting back to my normal lifestyle you know um, so so yeah I, I don't regret this little decision even though it's you know hurting on the short term because it's hurting more than the injury and stuff but see with the injury though it was mental anguish too because it was like every day I felt my knee you know do weird things and stuff like before the surgery 
Yeah. And now it's like I'm not necessarily feeling that. Like I don't feel like my knee is floating and stuff. You know, it's like it's 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 kind of feeling normal now. You know, um, of course it's still swelled up and still healing from the surgery. But I'm just saying there's no like like yesterday I mentioned there was some clicking noises and stuff and um, yeah. So I'll talk to my doctor about that. Um, but. But yeah, like uh, that that's the only thing though, you know? Um So yeah, all right. Well, that's my update for today. And tune in tomorrow. All right? Okay. Uh thanks for watching. <laughs>